So I'm Tony. Um, I'm a city planner uh, with the Department of Planning and Economic Development. I'm the liaison planner for Rondo. Um, so I'm here supporting the community and eating good food and talking to people and enjoying myself. So tell me, what do you think about what you just witnessed and experienced? I, I thought it was beautiful. I, I loved it. Just bringing people together through food and good conversations and kind of learning about, um, you know, what pe different things that people are doing around food justice in the community, and I'm excited to uh, uh, continue this work on our end with the city, uh, try to work on a neighborhood food plan pretty soon, so. Anything um, kind of highlight for you tonight? Anything, st you know, stuck out? Uh, I, I just liked all the different kinds of food. That was my, my favorite part, I think. Uh, just, yeah, talking to people. And you also recently went on a garden tour, right? I did. Okay. I did. Uh, went and saw all the gardens in Rondo, um, starting a, a beautiful thing, I think. Um, and I hope it continues and grows. And uh, yeah. <laughs> part of that tour was uh, part of the uh, Urban Farm Garden Alliance. Mm -hmm. And I think uh, you ended up at uh, Frogtown Farm. Yeah. And that's where most of this food came from that the uh, restaurants prepared today. Mm -hmm. You know, so you was tasting stuff that you had seen with your own eyes, yeah. you know? <laughs> keeping, it, keeping it local, right? Yeah. <laughs> also, you know, in your position, do you, uh, do you see the benefit of land use for urban farms? Uh, definitely. Uh, I think it's, uh, you know, helps build communities. Um, I think it helps build local economies. So, you know, we're sourcing all the food and then giving it to restaurants in the community. Um, so I think it's... Yeah, definitely beneficial and something we should continue and try to support as much as we can. Is there any type of insight that you could maybe give local um, organizer, gardening organizers, about how to uh, work with the city to reclaim some of the particular empty spaces, mm. green spaces? Um, yeah, I don't know if I have any good good insight. I think it's something that um, we got to explore and we got to, you know, try to say that it's something that we want to do, um, especially, you know, we're working on the neighborhood plans for both Frogtown and Summit U, uh, so that's something I think we should include in our plans and then, um, you know, bring it to the higher ups and say this is what the community wants and this is what we want to do. Well, I want to invite you to our next uh, community meal. Um, this project is a collaborative, have you heard of four groups, and they each are having a community meal. This is the second one. The third one is December 3rd, and it's a Greens Cook-Off, and uh, it, it seems like you like food a whole lot, man. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, you know, I'm going to check with the organizers of that and see if maybe you can be a judge for the Greens. Would you be interested in yeah, that? Yeah, definitely, definitely. Okay. I love Greens. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well, I want to thank you for taking time, yeah. being here, and just taking time and talking to us. Yeah, thanks for having me. All right, thank you, Tony. <laughs>